Hey again, this is Levi Damien from Silver and Black Pride in SB Nation with another edition of Raiders Position Battles. To continue with the defense, we move inside to the big run stuffers, the defensive tackles. Like many positions on this team, the defensive tackle position has been overhauled. Gone are longtime starters Richard Seymour and Tommy Kelly, and here are projected starters Vance Walker and Pat Sims. Walker comes over from Atlanta where he spent the first four years of his career. He was a local product and was very well liked by the fans. The former seventh round pick toiled as a backup his first three and a half seasons before finally getting his shot midway through last season. He showed enough potential in his eight starts last season to warrant interest from the Raiders who offered him the chance to come into camp as the starter. I don't foresee Walker losing his starting spot in camp, but the guy who will be trying to prove that projection incorrect will be second year man Christo Bilukidi. The team spent a sixth round pick on him last year, and he's the only returning defensive tackle on the roster. He filled in some at nose tackle last season, but that's out of position for him. He's better suited as a three technique defensive tackle. That being said, the team won't always field a nose tackle, and in those instances, he could shift over and play alongside Walker. The current first team nose tackle is Pat Sims. He comes over from the Bengals, where he spent the first five seasons of his career. At 6'2", 310 pounds, he is every bit a nose tackle. He wasn't a full-time player in Cincinnati, and the Raiders are hoping to change that and give him the bulk of the snaps at the position. If Sims can't carry the load, he will have two hungry young players behind him fighting to take snaps, snaps from him. Rookie sixth round pick Stacy McGee and first year player Johnny Jones. This battle could end up anywhere from a good portion of the snaps to being among the final cuts, hoping for a spot on the practice squad. The final two defensive tackle hopefuls are Brandon Bear and Kurt Tafa Asao. Bear spent last season on the Raiders practice squad and Tafa Asao is an undrafted free agent rookie. Both players will be competing with Bill Keedy for the right to back up Vance Walker. There are some question marks in this rotation. Both starters are being given their first real opportunities to be full-time starters and we don't know yet how they will perform in that role. If either of them stumble, there is a group of very young, hungry defensive tackles ready to pounce on that opportunity. That's all for our defensive tackle position battles. Once again, I'm Levi Damien for Silver and Black Pride in SB Nation. Be sure and check out our YouTube channel for all the previous as well as the upcoming Raiders position battles. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in camp.